Pig's Christmas present. It is the night before Christmas at Peppa's house. Peppa and George are asleep. Mummy and Daddy are asleep. Granny and Grandpa are here too, and they're asleep. Who is that? Ho, ho, ho! It is Father Christmas. My last delivery! Oh, why do they have to make chimneys so small? Father Christmas is putting presents around the Christmas tree. It is very early in the morning. Come on, George! I suppose it's just about daytime. Pepper and George are excited it's Christmas. Everybody is excited it's Christmas. Look! Father Christmas has brought presents! <laughs> George has a toy boat. Boat, boat! Pepper has a rocket. Zoom, zoom! It says Grandpa Pig. Open it, Grandpa. Ho, 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 ho. Ooh, that's just what I wanted. It's a drone. I don't really like the word drone. I prefer to call it a quadcopter. What does it do, Grandpa? Watch this. The drone can fly. Ooh. And I can see what it is seeing on the controller. <laughs> Let's see what it can do. Wow! It's like a busy bumblebee! Buzz, buzz! <laughs> and how long does the battery last? I don't know. But when the battery runs low, it flies home all by itself. That's clever. At the moment, it thinks home is the North Pole. Because that's where Father Christmas lives. Exactly. Perhaps you should change the home setting before you play with it, Grandpa. Oh, there's plenty of time for that, Granny Pig. Here is Mrs Duck. <laughs> Hello, Mrs Duck. <laughs> Hello, it's me, Papa. <laughs> <laughs> What's that noise? It means the battery is running low. Here it comes! Yes, all the way home. Hooray! And home is <coughs> the North Pole. Ah, yes. Perhaps I should have changed that. The drone is flying all the way to the North Pole. Oh, what are you doing back here? Pepper and her family are having Christmas lunch. Don't be sad about losing your present, Grandpa. Well, it was fun while it lasted. Ho, ho, ho! Father Christmas! At our front door! Yes, I decided not to use the chimney this time. I had this large present to deliver again. My quadcopter! Grandpa Pig loves his drone. Everyone loves drones. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everybody! Families! Pepper and her friends are at Playgroup. Children, today we are going to do drawings of our families. Ooh. This is me. I live on my own in a very tall house. Sometimes my two sisters come to visit. And we play music. Greta plays bass, Gretel plays drums, and I play 
play guitar. Me rock. That is my family. Now it is your turn. <laughs> <laughs> this is me, Susie Sheep. I live with my mummy. She likes to push me on the swing. <laughs> Higher, mummy! Higher! <laughs> and that is my family. I am Mandy Mouse. Here is me with Mummy and Daddy. We like playing in the park. To you, Mandy. <laughs> to you, Daddy. <laughs> Everyone likes playing in the park. Who's next? Me. What a lovely drawing, Pedro. This is Mummy and Daddy and me, Pedro Pony. I have glasses. Daddy has glasses. Mummy has contact lenses. Amazing. How about the Panda Twins? Pandora and Peggy are doing their drawing together. Daddy is a police officer. And Mummy is a firefighter. Sometimes Daddy drives us in his police car. Daddy, can we do the siren? Yes, please can we do the siren. Now, girls, you know the siren is only for emergencies. Please! Oh, all right then. <laughs> Super! And Danny Dog? My Daddy is a sea captain. He has adventures on his boat. But now Daddy has come home to me and Mummy and he won't go back to sea ever, ever, ever again. <laughs> what a wonderful adventure. Who's next? I'm Penny Polar Bear. I live with my Mummy and my other Mummy. One Mummy is a doctor and one Mummy cooks spaghetti. <laughs> I love spaghetti. <laughs> Lovely, Penny. And Freddy Fox? My dad has a van. It has everything in the world inside it. In packs of five. <laughs> Super. And Rebecca? This is me with Mummy, Daddy, Richard, Rosie and Robbie. We live in a hill. Sometimes my auntie Miss Rabbit visits. Oh, it's nice to have a break from all my jobs. Rescue service, please. I'm stuck up a mountain and I need rescuing. Oh, Dad, not again. OK, I'm on my way. Miss Rabbit is always busy because she does all the jobs in the world. Yes, what would we do without Miss Rabbit? Who's next? I am Peppa Pig. And this is Mummy and Daddy and my little brother George. George thinks his toy dinosaur is scary. <coughs> it is not scary. But if I don't play, he cries. <coughs> it's hard work having a little brother. <laughs> The parents are here to collect the children. Hello. Hello, mummies and daddies. Come and find yourself on our wall. Oh, is that me? Yes, mummy. And that's you, daddy. Oh, oh, it looks exactly like me. Yes, what wonderful drawings of the families. I love families. Peppa <laughs> loves families. Everyone loves families. <laughs> Motorbiking. It is a lovely sunny day in <laughs> Granny and Grandpa Pig's garden. Pepper and George are helping Grandpa Pig with his raspberry patch. A little bird has come to look at Grandpa Pig's raspberries. <coughs> ah! Shoo, shoo! Cheeky birds. Eat my raspberries, would you? The little birds like your raspberries, Grandpa. So do I. It's a good job I'm here to make sure they don't eat them all. Grandpa Pig, I've just had a wonderful idea. Let's go camping. Camping? Camping! <laughs> we could camp in the garden. No, let's drive somewhere, find a nice spot and pitch a tent. But our car is at Grandad Dog's garage, being fixed. Oh, yes. 
What about the old motorbike? Motorbike? Yes. Grandpa and I have had many adventures on our motorbike when we were younger. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes. That was fun. But it was a long time ago, Granny Pig. All the more reason for us to get the old motorbike out again. <laughs> Here it is. Motorbike! <laughs> What's this funny thing on the side? It's called a sidecar, Pepper. You and George can sit in it. What about my raspberries? You can't take your garden with you, Grandpa. Come on, it'll be fun to get away for a bit. I suppose so. But if we're going to go, I just need to make sure my raspberries will be safe. Pepper and George, you play in the garden while I pack a bag for the trip. OK. <laughs> there. What are you doing with your raspberries, Grandpa? I'm keeping them safe from those pesky birds. Are you planting them in your shed? Um, sort of. Here we are, bags packed and ready to go camping. What are you wearing, Granny? This is my motorcycle jacket. It keeps me warm on the motorbike. Oh, my raspberries will now be safe and sound. Let's go. Very good. Do you have the helmets and goggles? Here they are. You must wear a safety helmet if you ride on a motorbike. All aboard. Yes, yes Granny Pig. Pig. Which way should we go? That way. The seaside. Hooray! Whee! <laughs> <laughs> This is Grandad Dog's garage. Hello! Hi. Fill her up, please, Grandad Dog. Granny Pig! I didn't know you had a motorcycle. Yes, we're using it while you fix our car. Well, the car is fixed. You can take it now. Oh. oh. If you don't mind, I think we'll pick it up later. We're having too much fun on the motorbike. Bye. 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 Granny's, Granny's motorbike goes brum, brum, brum all day long. <laughs> <laughs> Pepper and George have arrived at the seaside. Hooray! Let's camp here. But, Granny, we've forgotten the tent. No, we haven't, Pepper. This is a very special camping motorbike. Watch this! Wow! The motorbike has turned into a tent. It's a magic tent. Yes, Pepper. We've got everything we need to sleep by the sea. Hooray! I hope you're not missing your raspberries too much, Grandpa Pig. Not at all because I made a few adjustments to the motorbike this morning and brought my garden too. Wow! Your raspberry patch! <laughs> Grandpa Pig loves camping, especially when he can bring his garden with him. Trampolines! Pepper and her friends have come to the trampoline park. I've never bounced on a trampoline. I bounce lots. It's the best thing ever. <laughs> Welcome to the trampoline park. Miss Rabbit is in charge. When you bounce, you must bounce safely. Yes, yes Miss Rabbit. Rabbit. First, take your shoes off. <laughs> <laughs> Only one person on each trampoline at a time. Always bounce in the middle. And no clever tricks, just bouncing. It looks fun. Yes, really fun. I might even have a go myself. Happy trampolining, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> this is brilliant. Yes, but these mini trampolines are for little children. <laughs> these are the trampolines for big children like us. <laughs> now we can do really big Pepper and Rebecca are doing big bounces. <laughs> I love bouncing. <laughs> I am bouncing higher than the star. Me too. And me. <laughs> bounce, 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 bouncing up so high. Bounce, 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 bouncing in the sky. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I think I'll have a 
have a go. Hey! <laughs> Look, Peppa, your daddy is on a trampoline. <laughs> Are you sure that's a good idea, Daddy Pig? I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I want to go too. <laughs> and me. on the trampolines. Bounce, 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 bounce bouncing up so high. Bounce, 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 bouncing in the sky. Mummy Pig is bouncing really high. Bouncing up so high. Not too high, Mummy Pig. Bouncing in the sky. <laughs> Woo! Mummy Pig has landed on top of a tree. Oh, how do I get down? Don't worry, Mummy Pig. We'll rescue you. Uh, we'll call Miss Rabbit's rescue service. Hello, trampoline park. Oh, the emergency telephone. Hello, rescue service. Mummy Pig is stuck in a tree. I'll be right there. Miss Rabbit to the rescue! My goodness, this is embarrassing. Yes, it's the sort of thing that normally happens to me. Don't worry, Mummy Pig. We'll have you down in no time. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. Hmm. I can't land on the tree. I know. I've got a really good idea. Oh, where's she going? Whee! She's bouncing back into the sky. Here I come. Whee! Wow! This is unbelievable. Yes, it is one of my more amazing rescues. What happens next? Who knows? That was lucky. I forgot the helicopter was here. Hooray! Thank you for rescuing me, Miss Rabbit. Just doing my job. Next time, don't bounce quite so high. Yes, Mummy. If you bounced on trampolines, you must bounce safely. Thank you, Peppa. I'll remember that in future. <laughs> Peppa loves trampolines. Everyone loves trampolines. Heaps! Peppa and George are at playgroup with their friends. Children, today we are going to play with hoops. Ooh. Playing with hoops is a super fun way to exercise. And exercise is good for you. Yes! Exercise gets your body working and your heart pumping. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> <laughs> OK, take a hoop each. <laughs> there are lots of ways to exercise with a hoop. We will start by throwing it into the air like this. Hoopla! And catch. Now you try. Hoopla! Very good. Now let's try rolling your hoops along the floor and running after them. <laughs> now lie your hoops on the ground. Add the jump from one hoop to the other. Jump, 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 jump. Jump, 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 j
children. <laughs> Look, Mummy, we've got hoops to take home. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Daddy, Daddy, look what we've got. Wow, hoops. They are for exercise. I see. Madam Gazelle says exercise makes your heart go, uh, boom, bang, boom. That sounds great. You throw them up in the air like this. Hoopla! Hoopla! And catch them like this. Very good, Daddy. And you roll them like this. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> and you jump on them like this. <laughs> oh, that looks fun. You can do it too, Mummy. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that was good. My heart is certainly going boom, bang, boom. <laughs> but the best thing ever is to spin the hoop like this. Oh. Uh, it's very hard to do. May I have a go? OK. But don't be sad if you can't do it, Mummy. Right, here we go. Ready, steady, go! <laughs> Mummy Pig can spin the hoop. Wow! Very good! Have another go, Pepper. Ready, steady, go! Ah, uh, I'll never do it. I've got an idea. Hold on, don't move. Where is Daddy going now? <laughs> I think this will do it. You've got to spin the hoop. What you need is music to spin to. Ready, steady, go! Hooray! Peppa can spin her hoop. George can spin his hoop. We're doing it, George! <laughs> you clever piggies. Peppa and George love spinning hoops. Everybody loves spinning hoops. <laughs> Jelly! Mummy Pig is working on her computer. Mummy, can me and George play on the computer? Sorry, Pepper. I've got a lot of important work to do today. Oh. You two can help me in the kitchen. OK. There's a cupboard in here that needs a jolly good tidy. <laughs> Could you pass me a pan, please? Here's a pan, Daddy. Thank you, Peppa. <laughs> Thank you, George. What is this funny thing? That is a special bowl for making jelly. Ooh, I like jelly. <laughs> can we make some jelly? Good idea, Peppa. Maybe it can be a surprise for Mummy Pig. Yes! First, we need to go to the shops and get everything we need to make jelly. <laughs> Goodbye, Mummy Pig. We're just popping out. OK, see you later. Daddy, Pepper and George have come to the supermarket. Daddy, what things do we need to make jelly? Well, we don't need flour or eggs or milk or butter. To make jelly, we just need a... Uh, Jelly. It doesn't look very wibbly or wobbly. We add water to make it wibbly wobbly. Oh. What flavour do you want? Cheese. George <laughs> likes cheese. I don't think they have cheese jelly, George. Oh. There is strawberry, orange, or lemon flavour. I like strawberry. Remember, the jelly is for Mummy Pig. What do you think she would like? Hello, Pepper and George. Hello, Miss Rabbit. Can you guess what we're making? Let me see. Are you making jelly? Yes. I love jelly, all wibbly wobbly and delicious. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> we're back home, Mummy Pig. Very good. Right, let's make jelly. <laughs> First, we open the packet and take out the jelly cubes. Ooh, they are a bit wibbly and wobbly. We break the jelly cubes into a bowl and add some hot water. A grown-up must do this bit and stir. The water has gone strawberry. 
jelly colour. Yes, the jelly cubes have melted. Now we can pour it into the jelly mould. The fridge will make it go cold and wobbly. How long will it take? Not long. Let's set the timer. When the timer goes ping, the jelly will be ready. It's taking a long time. While we wait, let's make Mummy a card to go with the jelly. Yes! Pepper and George are drawing a jelly card for <laughs> Mummy Pig. Very good. What should we write inside? Um, dear Mummy, all this jelly is for you. Love from Peppa and George. Kiss, kiss. Um, please can you share your jelly with Peppa and George? <coughs> and can Daddy have some too? Lovely. The timer has gone ping and the jelly is ready. We just turn the mould over on the plate and out pops the... Jelly! It's wibbly and it's wobbly. Blah, blah, blah. The end. Mummy Pig has finished her important work. <gasps> Mummy's coming! Surprise! Surprise! <gasps> How wonderful! We made jelly! Ooh, my favourite. And it's all for you. And some for me and George and Daddy. Whipply wobbly jelly. Thank you. <laughs> Mummy and Daddy Pig, Pepper and George like jelly. Everyone likes jelly. <laughs> Mountain climbing. Today, Pepper and her friends have come to the climbing centre. Grumpy Rabbit is in charge. Hello, children. Today, we're mountain climbing. Ooh. Is it difficult? Yes, but it's fun too. I've climbed many mountains. Have you ever got stuck? Yes, once I was climbing a mountain and I couldn't go up or down. What did you do? I called Mountain Rescue! They came and saved me using a helicopter. Oh, Dad! Not again! Sorry! Rescue by a helicopter! Brilliant! Yes, but that won't be happening today. We haven't got mountains. We've got climbing walls. We call this one Mount Snowden. It's just like a real mountain. Apart from the fact it's little and made of plastic. Ah. And you're going to be wearing safety helmets. <laughs> <laughs> what are the bobbly colour bits? You use them to put your hands and feet on, like this. Wow! Who wants a go? Me, please. Like this. Very good, Pedro. <laughs> Which bobbly bits do I use? Any colour you want. OK, I'll do yellow. Susie Sheep is climbing using the yellow bobbly bits. Pepper is using the blue bobbly bits. This is fun! George, would you like a go? <laughs> George has climbed to the very top. Well done, George! My little brother is the best at climbing. <laughs> that was our little climbing wall. Now for our big one. May I present Mount Everest? Ooh. Mount Everest is very high. Yes, which is why nobody climbs Mount Everest without a safety rope. If I want to stop, I simply come down gently on the rope. Ooh. Who wants to go first? Are you sure, George? <laughs> Remember, you can come down any time on the rope. <laughs> George is climbing Mount Everest. Wow! wow. Oh, my goodness! That is high! George has reached the top. <laughs> Brilliant climbing! Oh dear, George is a little bit worried. Hang on, 
George, Mummy's coming. Stop! You can't climb without a rope. It's against the rules. No time for rules. I have to rescue George. <laughs> Mummy's here. Do you feel better now, George? <laughs> George is not worried anymore. Hooray! Good. Down you come, George. Well done, George. <laughs> Hello. What about me? How do I get down? Hmm. For you, we will have to call Mountain Rescue. Hello? Mountain Rescue, please. Oh, Dad! You're not stuck up a mountain again? Not me. It's Mummy Pig. She's on Mount Everest. What? The actual Mount Everest? No, the plastic one. I'll be right there. Hang on, Mummy Pig. Woohoo! Mummy Pig is rescued. Hooray! Mummy, was it fun being rescued? Uh, it was kind of fun, I suppose. Mummy Pig <laughs> loves mountain climbing. <laughs> Everyone loves mountain climbing. 